Well, hello there. Today I'm gonna be getting another legendary. Um, I've been kind of falling behind. I feel I haven't really been pushing up high because my cards are kind of honestly kind of weak. I've been trying to upgrade them, but you know you can only do so much if you don't spend money. So I'm gonna be trying to see if this new legendary will help me. Uh, I've been debating whether or not to buy it, but of course um, I asked a lot of people and they said I should. And I do have 500 gems, and this is probably the best um, use I'm gonna get out of them. So let's see what I get. Um, I honestly could get anything. I feel like the log would be the worst card I can get because although the log is very good, um, it will not upgrade anything. While if I get any other legendary, it would either be upgraded. Or unlocked so yeah anyways let's see what I get and hopefully it isn't terrible oh all right I got the inferno dragon which right now I would say is actually the one of the worst legendaries to get um, because of the fact that it's so easy to counter um, the Inferno Dragon. Ooh, another legendary. Eh? Super easy to counter. Low health, um, mediocre health, low speed. Um, range is pretty bad. Um, yeah, but you know, it does a lot of damage if locked onto something. So yeah. Um Of course it goes uh pretty good. It goes pretty well with the lava hound. And so yeah. I have this deck that I've been using. Not too good, but I feel like the, um, the Lava Hound might be pretty good. Or not the Lava Hound, but the um, Inferno Dragon. So speed, medium, I'm just checking the speed. I might replace it with the Musketeer, even though it's a level 7. And so yeah, today is just going to be um a fun a fun day, right? I'm just this is just going to be for fun, really. Um yeah, I don't know, probably not going to get any wins, or at least try, but I don't know. Uh, the Lava, the Inferno Dragon goes really, the one problem that I have with this deck is I don't have a lot of port with, I don't have a lot of support with my um, Lava Hound. Of course, the Musketeer was good support, the Musketeer, as well as minions and, you know, the this. But if I put the Lava Hound in front, they'll of course throw in a giant right on my bridge or elite barbarians or stuff like that. And so with this, it may kill the tank really fast and support the Lava Hound, which is pretty good. Um, fair, I'm, this deck is fairly weak against like Musketeers. Um, that Maybe I need to reconsider that. Musketeers, Wizards. You know, the cards that shoot behind in the back. Electro Wizards, Ice Wizards, uh, Princess. But hopefully I can tornado them out into the Inferno Dragon. Or uh, minions, perhaps. But we'll see. Um, hmm. Maybe I should replace one of these with um, Archers. So I can have more support. I think I'm going to replace... Um, I want to use arrows, definitely. Uh, so I might want to replace Zap. Nah, I'll test this out. Let's go. I'll test it out like this. We'll see. But, yeah. I'm playing three spells. Zap, Arrow, and Tornado. I really want to use the Tornado. Get, get um, good at playing it. But um, Zap and Arrows are really just utility. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna have to get ready for a big push that's gonna be supported by this Ice Golem. Ice Spirit on the other side, that's pretty good for me. Inferno Dragon, alright, Inferno Dragon gonna kill the um, Hog Rider. Zapping the Inferno Dragon, which I'm fine with. Now, as you see, I have little support for everything, so... See, you're gonna have to waste Archers. I'm gonna throw in Skeleton Army because they already use Zap on the Inferno. And there goes my Skeleton Army. I'm gonna throw in minions for support. And Musketeer. Oh, uh, that's not gonna be good. Musketeer is gonna wreck my Inferno Dragon. 
But I'm gonna get some decent damage. So, yep. Throw it on this. This seemed to work well. This person has, um, what's it called? May zap it, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm gonna. Oh, that was a terrible, um, torna uh, tornado. Because of the fact that <laughs> it didn't do anything. Now I'm gonna play my skeleton army to kill the, um, that thing. I didn't realize the, um, the hog rider was that low in health, but you know, I am level 8, or I am level 10, which is very good. Gonna zap the archers, hopefully, can kill them. No, I cannot. Um, I have decent damage on the other side, so it's not to complain. Um, maybe something like this. Oh no, the tornado didn't hit the hog rider. All right, zapping. Um, that's bad. Yeah, uh, not not terrible, but definitely I'm gonna see some elite barbarians coming. Yep. There's nothing I can do about that. Um, well, I mean, I can do something like this. But yeah, um, ooh, okay, the Inferno Dragon is not going to do anything. This is not good. I'm going to tornado everything to the center. Uh, another Lava Hound. Uh, more minions. Uh, I'm gonna throw in a skeleton army, probably gonna get zapped, but they already zapped. Ice Golem gonna kill my um, skeletons. Tombstone, I can tornado everything down. Zap, yeah, no, I couldn't do anything. Um, the misplay with the tornado really cost me a lot. Um, when they used the Elite Barbarian push. Yeah, but Inferno Dragon, super bad. My skeleton army seemed a bit bad as well. We'll see. Um, yeah, I've been losing a lot, as you can see. But, yeah. Hmm. No, I think this is good for now. I didn't use arrows at all. But, if my opponent has minions, then it's like game over. So, maybe I'll do this. Hopefully, this will counter minions. Um, yeah. Uh, minions. I can zap them or tornado them. Seems fine. But, now I have no minion counters. So it's not going to be too good. Yeah, it's really hard playing um, Tornado, Zap, and Arrow in one deck. But yeah. I'm going to put Minions. That's fine. For now. I'm going to put um, this right here. And then I'm going to put um, Lava Hound right here. here. And I am screwed because of this, um, what's it called? Because of this, um, the graveyard. And look at that mega minion single-handedly destroyed my lava hound. And that's it. Fireball killed all my other, uh, killed my minions. Mm-hmm. Still having trouble with mega minion, as you can see. I really don't. Still, in my opinion, the best card in the game right now. We're throwing another tombstone. Maybe they will minion. They will minion. I'm gonna risk archers here. I don't want them destroying my minions. Alright, I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, I'm gonna go in with Inferno Dragon in the back. Lumberjack not gonna do too much. Wait until that happens. Alright, that's good. Um, I, last time they fireball, so I'm gonna hold zap and tornado. Yeah, they fireball zap. Zap now, because if they go to my tower, I'm gonna have to zap them then as well. Minions, I can't do anything about that. I don't have arrows. Which is too bad. But now they have nothing to counter my tombstone. I, I should put my tombstone in the back. I'm gonna start doing that, if I get another chance to. So anyways, Archers, Inferno Dragon, and Lava Hound. Um, again, Fireball is a threat here. I'm going to move everything closer to my stuff. 
don't want to get a vulner. I don't want to be vulnerable to again. Um, what's it called? Um, fireball. So I'm trying to place everything out. There's the fireball, finally. Um, but yeah, I can't get much going. Um, put minions there. I'm gonna tornado here. Oh, my f my tower was distracted on the, um, the thing the whole time. I'm expecting mega minions, so I'm gonna put archers there. Uh, zap, not bad, but now my mega minion will get killed by that. Minions here, tombstone here to kill the 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 skeleton army. Now at this point, I don't think I can win. So I need to watch out for the graveyard. And yeah, here, there comes the graveyard. I think for the most part, I'm gonna zap. I think for the most part, that's good. I'm gonna throw minions in front. Um, but yeah, this person can slap down a mega minion, and that's fine. This guy might be, actually be a fireball away, so I'm gonna have to put a lot of stuff. Uh oh. The skeletons! No, the skeletons got me! Alright, that's another game that I lost. Seems that the Inferno Jag is not doing too good, is it? Um, but yeah, again, I couldn't seem to get through the Mega Minion. The Mega Minion just got through my, um, my dragon too fast. Was that only two games? Wow. I felt, felt like it's been a hundred games. But I'll try one more match. Make this a short episode. Maybe two more actually. Um Yeah, no, I can't I can't do tornado. Tornado is not working out. Has not been working out, so gonna have to go with lightning. As my mega minion killer. Lightning only purpose lightning has is to kill a mega minion. And I can go with arrows. So now it's a pretty expensive deck. May want to replace Archer. I'll keep it like this. Um, we'll see. You know, changing my deck around might not might not be a good idea, but I'll definitely test out the Inferno Dragon after, after this. I'll start with archers. They're gonna start with the tombstone. Mhm. Mm yeah, I don't have anything good. So all right, they're gonna play Inferno Dragon. Hopefully they don't have Mega Minion, but we'll see. Um, oh, I'm standing at full elixir. That's horrible. I was distracted. So Inferno Dragon to meet up with the Lava Hound. And of course they have Mega Minion. And they're going to throw in, um, what's it? Ma and they're going to throw in a Graveyard. They have the Arrow, the Lava Pups. Now they're already setting up. Yeah, this doesn't... Interesting. The Mega Minion. Alright, so I'm gonna defend until... um Until Double Elixir. Then hopefully I can get something going. We'll see. But definitely the Inferno Drag is a good counter to the Lava Hound. So I have that. If I have anything going for me, it's that. But uh, the Mega Minion, the Mega Minion is going to be the, um, the hard thing to get. Maybe I'm going to place Minions to kill the Mega Minion once it gets summoned. Oh, summon that in the back. Um, this, Archers right there. Archers hopefully get rid of the Mega Minion. As the Valkyrie comes, I'm going to arrow. And, alright. Not the best, but again, I think I can... Start for the lava hand push now. Uh huh. I'm gonna place it down. I'm gonna go with aggressive lava hand. Put mine in front. No mercy. I'm gonna put skeleton army and archers, kind of. Yeah, I was gonna put minions, but I was afraid of. I was afraid of arrows, and I was correct. Mega Minion, I'm gonna use Lightning to kill the Mega Minion. And they're gonna use um, Zap. 
Alright, at this point, I should just defend. Alright, this person using Tombstone and gonna use a Lava Hound to defend. I think I got it. Yeah, the tower's pretty low. I'm pretty sure I can just, um, Lightning. Arrows. I'm gonna put Archers, I mean. And Skeleton Army. This person probably will Arrow, but my Lava Hound is, um, sneaking his way up. And the Lava Hound itself is gonna do a lot of damage. I'm gonna Arrow. And one more hit. That's game. Alright, pretty shaky game, but again, Lightning counter the Mega Minion. Definitely um good. We'll try I'll try one more match. Maybe talk about a story that I had. Yeah, I'll talk about it. So a few days ago, um I was eating rice with fish and I had a fish bone that was stuck in my throat. And yeah, I mean it's been stuck there, and, <clears throat> and it's been a few days, and like every time I swallow, it's like getting one of those numb shots when you're in the hospital. Um, I don't know what to do here. I think I'm gonna archers. Um, it's like getting one of those numb shots. Uh oh, this is not good. It's like getting those one of those numb shots every time you swallow, so it's not really that good. But um, I like I couldn't get the bone down. Like I couldn't swallow the bone. But after a little while, um, today actually, the bones seem to have disappeared. I probably explained it terribly because I was trying to defend a freaking Lava Hound level 2. This person seems to be playing the same thing I'm playing. Or very similar. But they do have the Mega Minion. So this is where my Lightning will kill both the Mega Minion and Inferno Dragon. Which doesn't seem terrible. Um, archers to get rid of the skeleton army and hopefully to lock onto the um, inferno or not the inferno the mega minion or I'll just do um, three of these prepare arrows because I do remember this person having minions this person is gonna fireball probably gonna minion very soon okay well they did but I didn't see it my fingers were covering it I'm gonna lightning because this person seems to be wasting a lot the lightning actually killed the minion so now nothing will hit me. Um, I was gonna arrow, but they that may trigger a lava hound pushed right into my face. So I'm gonna put minions instead, and they will um, hit the tower, or or they will hurt this person's tombstone. Um, this person actually has very similar level stuff than I do, which is pretty good. But yeah, I had a bone stuck in my throat, and a lot of people are telling me to go to the doctors. I got my teachers, but I'm like, nah, I'm fine. Now this is going to be, this is where my lightning is going to shine. My lightning is going to kill um, the Inferno Dragon and the Mega Minion. And it's going to be good. I'm going to arrow that. Lightning back here. Boom, boom, boom. Beautiful. And look at, look at all that damage. Alright, this person does not seem to want to give me anything. Or whatever that's supposed. What did I just say? I have no idea what I just said. Arrowing all that seems pretty good. And now I'm gonna throw in a lava hound in front if I can. Um, sweet lava hound is in front. Um, I'm gonna not throw in minions. I'm gonna put in instead. I'm gonna put in minions and lightning. Uh, minions gonna take care of that mega minion, and I'm gonna lightning down the tombstone, and that. Mega Minion doing a or not Mega Minion, Lava Hound doing a lot of damage. One lightning away. Let's try to cycle to the lightning. And okay, that's game. Well, it seems like this deck is way better than. Well, maybe not way better, but because of the lightning, it could have took, it took care of the Mega Minions. So yeah, <clears throat> I am back where I am when I started this video. All right, definitely fun trying to play something new. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, that, that would be the Inferno Dragon. Honestly, out of my wants list, when I was looking at that legendary chest, it was either a level 2 Lava Hound or an Inferno Dragon. Cause, because I really want to use my Inferno Dragon to push, and I felt that, or the Lava Hound to push, and I felt the Inferno Dragon will complement it very nicely. 
or the miner, I suppose. But yeah, I'm pretty happy to get the Inferno Dragon, actually. Um, I'm going to be playing it a lot. May it's actually one of the worst legendaries, but... Um, but I feel like it's not bad. Like, in that battle, and in the last battle, these two last battles have actually been Lava Hound Mirror matches. And it seems that I do a lot better against Lava Hounds. Like, I have Lightning... To take care of Mega Minion and Inferno Dragon. As well as the Inferno Dragon to get rid of the Lava Hound. Um, against both decks I did well well. And of course arrows for the Minions. Minion Horde. Or the Pups. So yeah pretty pretty good. Pretty good. And then the last two matches were just not good. Um, the Tornado. I really want to use the Tornado. I have a level 4 Tornado. Uh, maybe it's not fit for the ladder. Maybe it's more fit towards um, tournaments. But yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching. That has been me. Um, little story, little um, story about the bone, fish bone in my throat. Um, I'm I'm pretty sure it's gone. Um, I woke up this morning and I think it's gone. It's been stuck in like three days or for two days right now, and I think it's gone. Maybe it's still there. But if I can't talk or I talk differently or I had like surgery for the throat to remove a fishbone, uh, you'll know why I informed in this video. But yeah, alright, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time with perhaps more stuff. I don't know, more stuff, different stuff. Alright, see you guys then.